Hi guys, welcome back to the Chronic Illness Diaries. I am so sorry that I haven't been on for a while. Um, things have been kind of rough. Uh, so, I've mentioned in my previous vlogs that heat is a problem. Um, heat makes me pass out. Um, I have Graves disease and dysautonomia, which make me extremely heat intolerant. And then I have mast cell disorder, which causes like hives and rashes um, with the heat. So a couple of weeks ago, I um, my central line, which was on this side, had gotten like a rash all around the, the tape um, or the dressing. I can only use one type of dressing. Um, I react to other ones, so I'm very limited. Anyway, uh, I had been told by my nurse that I could just put like some sterile gauze, like clean the area really well, you know, sterilely, and then put like sterile gauze over it and change that out every day. I'm not sure if that was the problem. I know that some people are able to do that and that's fine, like they don't ever have any issue uh, while their skin heals. Oh, sorry, I'm out of breath. <laughs> but I um, noticed that there was just a little bit of drainage coming around the line and it was getting like every hour it was getting more and more painful. So I called my interventional radiology team. Um, they've been with me for five years and have done all of my lines. I called them and the doctor recommended that I go to the emergency room, be admitted, and that he would replace the line the following day as long as they didn't think I had sepsis. So I went to the ER and of course when you're on steroids um, sometimes you don't have like the normal reactions. You don't have like redness or swelling. So just by looking at the line it looked great. However it was extremely painful and um, anyway they did some blood cultures and tests um, they admitted me, and the following day, I had uh, my central line removed and a new one put on this side. So, uh, I was in the hospital about three days. My blood cultures came back clear, so that was good. It was just a localized infection um, to the skin and the surrounding area. I was on some IV antibiotics, and... Um, things are going better now, thankfully, so I will check back in with you soon. I just wanted to give you a brief update. I hope you're all doing well. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.